Working waterfronts are an integral part of the soul and character of the nation's coasts. This rich and dynamic maritime heritage is perhaps most evident right here in the New York, New Jersey metropolitan region. The engine of growth that propels our region is our majestic seaboard. From crates on wooden ships arriving to Dutch New York almost 400 years ago, to today's massive container ships that are four football fields long, the working waterfront has remained core to our regional economy and we continue to benefit from its dynamic growth. More than ever, especially in difficult times, we recognize the long-standing history and importance of the region's maritime sector. From our dock workers and longshoremen, to our busy ports and terminals, to our harbor cruises and ferries, these institutions have stepped up after 9-11, during blackouts, after Hurricane Sandy, and through many other crises to keep us safe, to keep us moving, and to keep our region strong. In recent months, during the worst pandemic of our generation, the maritime sector has risen to the challenge by keeping vital supplies from medical equipment to food flowing into the region, ensuring our supply chains are strong and our shelves are stocked during COVID-19. Always preparing for change, today the working waterfront is adapting to larger vessels, new innovations, and the specter of climate change impacting our waterfronts and waterways. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, serving our nation since colonial times, has been at the nexus of our waterfront's evolution, most recently expediting the dredging operation that allowed the USNS Comfort to dock on the west side of Manhattan. The Army Corps is at front and center in the nation's response to climate change and resilience. Through its skilled planning, engineering design, construction, operations and maintenance, and research and development activities, the Corps is responding to more frequent and more powerful natural hazards, man-made adverse events, changing conditions, and increasing uncertainty. In its 99th year of existence, the Port Authority of New York and New Jersey is a local economic driver supporting 400,000 regional jobs. It has become the second largest container port in the United States and has been repositioned to meet 21st century needs, including new larger Neo Panamax vessels. And the port is preparing for the next 30 years through its master plan, which anticipates rising cargo volumes and a greener, more resilient and sustainable port. To the men and women behind the scenes, longshoremen, dock workers, captains, and engineers who keep our port and our waterways alive, we thank you. You are essential. We thank and recognize all our heroes of the harbor today and every day. Welcome to the Waterfront Alliance's Heroes of the Harbor Celebration.